So you're going to take off your kill switch. Then you got your everything separated for this particular model, but you know, you just do what you have to do. Then you're left with your your wine, your winding uh your spring, right? And you rewind whatnot, whatever you want to call it. Excuse me here. Uh, so then you can see I'm on a tripod here. So you can see, you know, I mean I'm looking at a foot and a half of rope, right? Now on some models, because I'll show you, you see it's held in with these little dogs here. I'll call them dogs, but they keep this held in. So you wouldn't be able to, on some, like a lawnmower, sometimes you can just, you know, go around with the rope like I'm going to show you, and you don't need the notch. But some have the notches because this, well, you'll see when, when I do it, this notch will allow the rope to come in under this, these two. All depends on how many turns, but I'll need two at least. So uh, you'll see uh, when I show you. So this is, you know, some people may think, hey, you know, everybody know this. You know, I knew this when I was, you know, knee high to a grasshopper. I don't know. But I know a guy showed me this a long time ago. And before that, you know, I was just doing it the hard way. So what you do, you line up that slot that I was showing you, right? Line up the slot to where the rope comes out. You hold this, hold it with your thumb. I got to pick, bring your rope up, make a loop, okay? Make a loop. Now take the part you can pull this up take the part that's going in the slot right and you just go see one see how it goes in under the um it allows it to go under these now hopefully this will work Beautiful. Yeah, I think a bit of grease or a bit of oil on that spring dog would work. It's kind of sticking at that point. One thing you do want to make sure, guys, that when you, uh, you know, pull your rope, that you're not maxim maxing out the spring. Okay? I got a little bit left, but not much. I had to cut a little bit off the spring. But, uh... But I'm fine because I know that, you know, I'm not going to pull it all the way out, right? I only pull it like that anyway. So just be mindful of that if if you are ma maxing out your spring, you know, uh, you're on. If you pull it all the way, you're going to snap your spring and ruin your day. So anyway, guys, that's uh that's the tip. And uh, I'm not going to show putting this back together. There's only six screws and putting linkage on. I mean, it's no, no big deal. But uh, I wish I would have known that when I first started uh, doing this, you know. But, uh, yeah, an old guy uh, showed me a little trick like that. Anyway, I hope it helps you if you have this problem, if you got a limp dick or um, a limp so rope. <laughs> I'm just joking. But um, thanks again, guys, and stay safe.